Hello traders, it's Friday again and it's time to see what I have achieved during the past week. Uh, for those of you who followed our Twitter account, they know that I've posted a closing signal on the trades that I was holding uh, during the past several weeks. I'm talking about the FTSE 100 and the CAC 40. Luckily last week I've managed to close some percentage of the profit. So over the overall loss is uh, relatively small. Uh, that's why I'm not uh, gonna bother with uh, those trades uh, today. So that's why let's uh, start with the recap video. First, I'm going to start with uh, the trade that I've posted in uh, Monday. It's uh, on the agricultural product corn, as you can see here. I, the chart is again on a daily time frame. Um, uh, as I mentioned in the video, this is going to be our action zone. I'm uh, gonna make the decision here. I was uh, mainly bullish on the trade. Um, unfortunately, in Monday, when I made the video, the price of the corn closes a little bit uh, uh, under the action zone. So on, on the next day, I was thinking, uh, should I go short or not? Uh, as you can see here, I don't know if you can see it properly, but uh, there, was a, there is a small uh, red uh, spike. The price entered into the uh, action zone. It was with a green candle. Um, I thought that uh, I'm gonna wait and after this uh, there was a huge uh, selling pressure. Um, I wasn't able to open a trade. It happens really fast. Uh, the, start, uh, the price started to drop. It stops here on uh, this uh, support level uh, here that we discussed uh, last time. And then uh, it even uh, breaks it and uh, reaches almost the main target on the short side. But that was really quick so I wasn't able to play it. If uh, some of you managed to extract money from this movement, this is really good please uh, uh, type me and uh, share it, share it uh, with us. Um, after this, uh, yesterday, it make a uh, green doji and I waited and uh, that was actually in uh, Wednesday. And uh, yesterday, as soon as uh, the green candle enters into the uh, action zone, I tweeted a sign in uh, YouTube. So I've uh, opened a trade on the long side. As you can see today, the price is uh, still into the action zone. Yes, uh, the candle is uh, still a red one, but uh, uh, hopefully uh, the, uh, the buying pressure will appear soon and it will uh, push the price uh, to the lock profit area or maybe even to our uh, main target. Uh, hopefully this will happen soon to the, uh, the next week. Uh, we'll keep monitoring the trade and we'll see how it's uh, going to develop. But up to now I'm uh, happy with the performance and I'm confident that uh, we're going to be able to extract uh, good money from this uh, trade. The next trade uh, that we're going to discuss is uh, the one from uh, Thursday. I've uh, posted uh, around the afternoon. It's uh, on the metal copper. As you can see again, the chart is on a daily time frame. Here the plan is as uh, follows. After this uh, huge drop, the price uh, stops uh, on this uh, support level. I've mentioned in the video that uh, the price had uh, breaks it uh, several times before, but in the last uh, uh, several uh, weeks uh, the price had stops uh, here precisely so that's why i'm confident that uh, probably this time it won't break it and it will bounce from it up to this point the trade is uh, performing well as you can see the selling pressure seems exhausted uh, the candle was even uh, green uh, just one hour ago uh, now it's red but uh, we'll see how it's uh, going to uh, close um, well, I haven't uh, this is a short-term trade so I haven't uh, posted a Twitter sign on it but uh, probably I'll uh, uh, post uh, something uh, today by the end of the day because I really like this trade and in my opinion it's uh, I'm going to be very profitable one so probably I'll give it as a bonus to all of our uh, followers in uh, Twitter and uh, hopefully we'll be able to extract a very good uh, uh, profit from it. Um, the plan uh, remains the same. Uh, as soon as uh, the price uh, bounces and starts to, to rise, it will, we are going to close some of the profit uh, here on this uh, resistance level. And if uh, the price uh, uh, breaks it through, and uh, may, probably it will make uh, some sort of a correction here. And it, if it continues rising and uh, reaches uh, the long term uh, target, we are going to close the whole exposure here and we are going to enjoy our profit. That was all about this uh, recap video. I hope you like it and uh, find it useful. Don't forget to follow us in our uh, social media accounts because uh, there the information that we are posted is uh, very useful and interesting and you might find it uh, very good for uh, upgrading your performance in trading. Also, if you want to see more of these videos, you can follow us in our YouTube channel. And thank you very much for your attention again. I wish you a nice and pleasant weekend and see you again next week. Bye-bye.